Okay, so here's a quick tip. When you don't find ideas for YouTube, all you have to do is to use your logic. <laughs> Yo, what's good everyone, it's new here and welcome back. So recently I was inspired by Logic's brand new single and it's called 44 More. The design is actually amazing, so I thought I would make a video on how to make a logo just like that. Okay, so the first thing that you have to do is to go ahead to the link in the description below and download this app, which I'm pretty sure that most of you are familiar with. This is Pixel Lab. We are going to be creating a text with this app. To edit the name, all you have to do is to press on the pen button right there and as you can see, you can edit the text. So just put your um, channel name. I'm going to be putting my channel name, which is Sinu. And basically, as you can see, now you have the text right over here. Next step, go ahead and search for the font button, which is somewhere right over here. So it's actually right over here. So press on it and just basically change the font because the default font is pretty bad. So you're going to go ahead and just search for a really outstanding um, font font so i think i'm going to be using right this one right over here this actually looks pretty dope and on your right you can see more options for example you can actually you know just resize it but uh, actually you're gonna go ahead now and go to the spacing option which is the option on the right right over here so press on it and basically it's going to give you this slider right over here now basically you're gonna go ahead and just increase the spacing i want you to have it around like 13 don't make it like something crazy like 20 or anything like that just make sure that the letters have a decent amount of spacing between them next up go ahead and press on this button Button and hit on transparent which should make the background transparent now we are pretty much over with the work uh, in pixel lab so last thing you're gonna go ahead and hit on this button right over here to save the project and make sure it says PNG right over here and just basically save the image all right so now we are ready to go to this app which you will find the link in description below it's going to allow you to download this app it's called photoshop touch on mobile basically you can get it on ios or android the link is in the description below as you can see i just imported the image that we created from pixel lab and this is just the text with the transparent background which is perfect this is exactly what we wanted Okay, now go ahead and press on this plus button right over here and hit on this empty layer option, then bring the empty layer down and then go ahead and hit on empty layer again. So now hit on the bottom empty layer, which is this one, and go to the fill and stroke and just fill the area with any color you want. And then you're going to go ahead and press on this middle empty layer. So once you press on it, uh, all you have to do next is to go and just change the selection uh, option. So basically, you want to go ahead and hit on this selection tool, which is the pale again selection tool. I'm not sure if this is how to pronounce it, but I'm also going to be using the show pointer option, which is going to allow me to be more precise in my selection. And overall, it's going to make it easier for me to select. So basically, go to the last layer of your uh, name, which is you in my name, and then go ahead and just put a point in the edge of of the letter and then go somewhere right over here in the middle and then go ahead and just put another point once that's done go ahead and go to the first letter of your name and go to the bottom edge of the letter and just put a point right over there and once you've done that just connect the selection and you should have this triangle you can just fill it with any color i'm going to be uh you know putting red just like this uh i think this color actually fits the design uh, and i just noticed that uh, logic used the black color on the uh cover 44 more for the text and since the cover is my inspiration i'm going to be changing the color to black just like this Okay, now it's the time to create that flat shadow effect on the text. So what you want to go ahead and do is that you want to go to the first letter of your name and go to the top edge of the uh, letter and put a point right over there. So just create points right over here. And next up, you want to go ahead and go to the bottom uh, of the this pyramid right over here and put another point right here. Now you're going to go ahead and just select around your layer and just 
connect this selection and you should have this uh, shape part over here hit on this end button right over here and hit on fill and stroke as you can see this is how to create the shadow effect now what you want to go ahead and do is that you want to go and just just repeat what we just have done to the c to the other letters the i the n the l and the u it should be pretty easy and a pro tip when you reach the middle uh, letter which is n in my case you don't have to select the edges or whatever all you have to do is to basically go and um fill the area just like this and you should be actually good to go and now let's go ahead to the l let's do the exact same thing but as you can see it looks pretty bad we have this really bad space between the n and the o it's really unrealistic and it's it really ruins the uh, whole image so i'm going to be cheating a little bit i'm going to drag the shadow over the end so that looks pretty clean as you can see and let's go ahead and go for the u and everything should be good to go okay guys so this is how you can make this really cool logo and i think it looks pretty cool so obviously my inspiration was uh, Logic's cover from the single 44 more. I think it's a really cool song if you guys want to check it out um, I think it's pretty cool. So this is how you can make this pretty amazing design I really love it and I encourage you guys to use it for your um, banner or logo or whatever So I would love to see you guys try it out. Thank you guys so much for watching this video I would appreciate it if you guys leave a like on this video and subscribe if you didn't enjoy me already Thank you guys so much for watching and I catch you guys next time. Peace out. Thank you.